this lady uh, touch your right leg. You, you, touch that leg. In Jesus' name. Jesus, my tenant. You demon. Oh, oh you dirty spirit. Come out. Come out. Leave this lady, you demon. Lady. So this is the picture of your mother. Yes. Huh? She's she, she's, she's got stroke. Yes. Mother, mama, don't worry, mama will be fine. <laughs> because this might come to you later on. Come on, come on. Come on. This woman here. Yeah? Come here, mama. This leg is giving you problems, mama. Come on. This is like stroke now. Yes. Huh? yes. You're, you're failing to walk. I want to pray for I want to see how you're working after this. In Jesus' name. Leave it, leave it. We're coming to you. Just give me 10 minutes. We're coming to you. I'm sure we'll be done soon. Come on. Come on. Jesus' name. Lift her up. Look here. Look here, mama. In Jesus' name. She's free. Greetings in the wonderful name of our Lord Jesus Christ, viewers all over the world. Welcome to Charis Missionary Church. This is our Wednesday live service under the leadership of Apostle JB and Prophetess T. E. Makanenisa. And with me here today is my mother, who was located during the service by Prophet Andres Simono, who ministered upon her life. Ma, please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. Extension <laughs> Mama, today during the service, Prophet Andris Bale Professor Ile, please tell us what he said and please confirm it. Uh, Prophet Andris, um, Prophet Ile Gale Gale Odolele Botoko, and I can need to tell you because Kapshu Ibile Kya Spetle La Gale Ona Odolele, so Kile Boka Mudi Mohore. So I'm happy about that. Mm. And Ma, how long have you been experiencing this leg problem and how has it affected you? It's from last week. So it's really a and we go to Pastor Makananis before you go. And how do you feel, Mama, that today the Prophet located your problem and he prayed for you? I'm happy about that because Amen. Mm. Jesus, my tenant. Ah! 
Where's your gun, sir? Where's your gun? Sorry? Where's your gun? They've robbed me. Uh, huh? they've who, took, robbed. who took your gun? No, it was criminal in 2010. Mm. Mm. Since then, there's been problems. Yes. You know, because the people that took your gun, they know you. Yeah, they know me, Pastor. You know, it's like this was well orchestrated plan. Yes. So let's allow God to, to forgive you. Because what I see now is like these people were very close to you. Yes. And they end up getting more information about you. And there are things that personally you've been doing that you also need to forgive yourself. Thank you, Pastor. So, but I believe God will fight for you. Thank you, Pastor. In Jesus' name. You're saying what? You're saying what? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Huh? Who are you? You don't want it to come here. I can't even get a cognac. Who can I get? So, some demons they are, they, are, they are happy that you're not coming here. Eh? Huh? It's what I was telling you when I was there. Sometimes you say I'm getting prayer. Demons are just laughing at you. I say, ah, look at you. Your, your father has misbehaved. Do you think you can be delivered? So that's why demons will, will, will make sure that people hate charis. You have to make sure of that. So you don't want her to come here? Huh? She must not come here. Huh? So who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Jesus name. Jesus name. See this demon is angry. Oh. Yeah. Angry. This, this this thing is a battle, it's not a child's play. It's a serious war. You hear that? Listen to that. Yeah. Angry. If God can open your eyes one day, you, you'll pray until the sun comes up like this. You'll never, when they give you food, you say, my stomach is full. You see, they'll give you food, you say, no, I don't want food. I don't want food. You say, because we live amongst very cruel people. Very cruel people. You know, to a point that you must never even a single day, you, 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 you relax. I was telling some of the soccer people that I play with them soccer, I said, you know, I come here many times and with no food here but I'll still come and exercise. <laughs> no food in the stomach, but I still exercise like there's food here. Because I don't want to relax. Jesus name. Jesus name. Jesus mighty name. 
ಪರಿಶ್ರಮಿಸ್ದೆ I'm not leaving you until this woman and this man are free. I'm not passing. Some demons here they get excited because I touch and pass. Leave you demon. I'm not leaving. Ari. Ari. Charan. O charan laguma, khopela mo dimo tsarela. Ari. Ari. Eh, tsamaya no, no. Like now. Ari. Just free. Sir, please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. Um, I'm coming from here in Midrand. Your name? Moses. Sir, today during the service, Prophet Andres located you and he spoke to you. Please tell us what he said and please confirm it. Um, I confirm it. Actually, when I started to come here, I came here being blind, not seeing. Mm. and my blind my blindness is caused by what the prophet has has already prophetized me um uh i'm i'm from another church the very big church where i've got a very big position and i'm respected there but i couldn't get help of my my sickness so when i started coming here that's where i started to see the the grace of god and also this prophecy that he told me today um it's really shocking and i believe it's true because now even in the family we we are separated like no one no one come even near me when i'm sick or my wife so i've seen the graces i've came here uh to the charis uh, church i've seen the the prophet is very true and you know first time when i came here i undermine it because of the the church where i'm coming from and the position that i've held it's quite a very big position in the church that i have of which I, i'm not going to say it which church but i'm very respected there where most of the people maybe where they can see me they will just like wonder that the person that we trust uh the person that is a role model in our church now he has seen the miracles i just want to thank god for the prophecy that is true and um i'm very grateful that now i'm healed as 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 i can see now i'm fine everything is fine thank you lord of cherries i really appreciate it thank you the death of your mom is still sitting in your heart well huh? the death of mama of your mom is still sitting in your heart i want you to know that jesus will take care of you amen you hear me amen sometimes you are afraid you feel like you are all alone i don't want you to worry god will take care of you amen in jesus mighty name This girl, come here. I touch you again. Your future is bright. Amen. In Jesus' name, you must not worry again. You, you want to pay lovola? Yes. No. Huh? Yes. You want to pay lovola? Yes. You are aware of the child? Y yes. No. Huh? Yes. Are you aware there's a child? Yes. Yes. This must be your bus station. Amen. Do you hear me? Amen. This must be your, your, your they call it park station. Amen. Oh, because this can end up becoming a spirit that will make you from here to there, there to there, there to there. This can end up messing up your life. Amen. I just see that there's a child coming. Uh, this pregnancy that is still small. You need to pray so that God can give you money you go and you marry God bless you Amen